Good evening and a welcome to Compline once again in the catio. If you're wondering why these are wobbling, we have a new shelf just about here which you can't see and Teddy loves to play with the baubles underneath. But let's forget about baubles and let's just have a moment of quiet as we begin this evening, shall we? you still the storm. Still me, O oh Lord. Keep me from harm. Let all the tumult within me cease. Enfold me, Lord, in your peace. Father, bless the work that is done and the work that shall be. Father, bless the servant that I am and the servant that I will be. Now, Lord and God of power, shield and sustain me this night. I will lie down this night with God, and God will lie down with me. I will lie down this night with Christ, and Christ will lie down with me. I will lie down this night with the Spirit, <laughs> and the Spirit will lie down with me. God and Christ and the Spirit be lying down with me. <coughs> We're looking at a new book this time and it's, <coughs> excuse me, a modern version of the Psalms. So I'm going to read it through slowly and then we'll have a time of quiet and move on. So this is a modern version <clears throat> of Psalm 1. Those persons who choose to live significant lives are not going to take their cues from religiously indifferent. Let me say that again. Those persons who choose to live significant lives are not going to take their cues from the religiously indifferent, nor will they conform to the crowd, nor mouth, mouth their prejudices, nor dot on the failures of others. Their ultimate concern is the will of God. They make their daily decisions in respect to such. Compare them to a sturdy tree, planted in rich, moist soil. As the tree yields fruit, so their lives manifest blessing for others and are purposeful and productive. This is, this is not true concerning the ungodly. They are like sand, exactly, in the desert storm, or leaves in an autumn wind. They cannot stand against the judgments of the eternal God. And they are most uncomfortable among those who demonstrate genuine faith. And those who demonstrate their faith in the God of righteousness. The children of God walk in the course that God has ordained. The children of unbelief walk in paths of self-destruction and as we have a moment of quiet let me read that last passage again the children of God walk in the course that God has ordained the children of unbelief walk in paths of self-destruction and as we move it to that quiet let's ask God to remind us of a phrase or a word that we've just heard and to think about it.
let's say the Lord's Prayer together, shall we? Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. <coughs> Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. The peace of God be over me to shelter me, under me to uphold me, about me to protect me behind me to direct me, ever with me to save me. The peace of all peace be mine this night, in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you for joining me for Compline again. It's wonderful to know that as I sit here there are others out there sharing this service with me. Let's continue to pray for all that is going on in the Ukraine. And let's keep ourselves safe and those around us safe. Good night and God bless you.